Hi everyone, this is Crafty Decoria and I hope everyone had a wonderful weekend. So I do have another Dollar Tree Monday haul to share with all of you. I managed to get to a couple of Dollar Trees this weekend and I found some new items. So that is always exciting. As usual, here is the overview of the things that I picked up. I will go through them one by one so that you can have a better look. I hope you enjoy. Haul, I have some food items. So I picked up these Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer cookies and these are the milk flavored straws. And I have not tried these before, but they looked really good, so I picked up a few packages of those. Then in the Twinkle Baker Decor line, I picked up these edible icing sheets. They are 4.3 centimeter round cupcake toppers. And I thought these were really neat. They have different sayings on them and I just thought it'd be an easy way to decorate a cupcake and they are edible so I thought that was great. Also from Twinkle Baker Decor I picked up these Deco Bonbons and these are the reindeer. I thought it'd be a fun way to dress up a cake pop or a cupcake so I picked up the reindeer and it is it says it's enough to do six faces and these also are gluten free and I picked up the snowman as well an item I always get excited to find at the Dollar Tree is this stone mill slow crafted bakehouse bread and these breads I normally purchase at my dollar uh, at my grocery store excuse me and these ones run close to about four dollars so to get them at the Dollar Tree for a dollar twenty five is an amazing deal and I don't always find them but this time around I grabbed most of them there still were a few loaves left but I had gotten enough here so the ones that I picked up and these are great because they are fermented for hours and they are non GMO and free of sugar so this one here that I picked up is the sprouted three grains I also picked up the sprouted rye and 12 grains one of my favorites is the Chia and Super Grains. And the last one that I picked up is the Sprouted Flax. So I was really happy to come across this bread. It says that it expires on the 13th of November, but as soon as I get home, I pop them in the freezer and I can enjoy them for a good while. Next, I picked up these three divider trays, and these are great for any type of parties or if you're crafting and you need something for organizing or for making DIYs. I also picked up from Craft Medley these wooden, natural wood napkin holders. You get two pieces in a package. Um, napkin holders are really hard to find at my Dollar Tree. I normally would pick up the silver napkin holders, the ones that are like rectangular in shape, but I haven't been able to find those. So when I do come across these ones, I like to pick them up, being that they are natural wood. So I did pick up the only two packages they had. These are new. I had actually mentioned these in my last DIY that I made with the farmhouse red truck banner and I had mentioned that I had some wooden, wooden letters but I had actually purchased them from Dollarama 
Well, I went to the Dollar Tree and now I saw that they had these wooden letters, which are great. And they are the perfect size for the red truck that the Dollar Tree sells. So these have 26 pieces in them. And if I get around to painting these up and showing the banner in a future video, then I will show you how it looks. But again, these are a great size for the back of the red truck. So I picked up two packages of those. And those are by Crafter Square. And then by Holiday Trends, I picked up these laser cut wood stickers. They are photo safe. And there's one sheet in here and you get six laser cut wood stickers. So I picked up the snowflakes as well as this one with the sled and gingerbread men. And then I also picked up these laser cut wood shapes. You get 15 pieces in a package by Craft Medley as well. And these were adorable owls, so I had to pick them up. Over by the cash area, they always put neat little items to kind of get you to get that last minute thing before you check out. So I did pick up some Mario Brothers items. The first here is the Super Mario Brother Wii danglers and stickers. You get six stickers with every dangler. So that's what they look like. I picked up this Skylanders Trap Team dog tags. You get one dog tag with a chain. And these are the different designs that they have. And then another Super Mario Brother Wii trading card fun pack. There's eight items in each package. You get the trading cards standy foil card tattoos and more they had these pet surprise collections and the first one that i picked up is like a little carrier and it is the pony collection and it says it contains a surprise toy candies and stickers The second one is the Puppy House collection. And again, filled with candy. And I guess you get a surprise puppy. But this one I thought was really cute because it's like a little dog carrier. And then it has this little tag attached to it that says this cage belongs to and then you can fill in the tag but I thought that was really cute and the third one that I picked up is the farm collection and again it contains a surprise toy candies and stickers so I thought that was pretty neat as well I was super excited to come across these and there were only two so I picked them both up. They are the Lord of the Rings and these have three packs inside plus one promo card with the free tin and the tin is actually a keychain. So for anyone who is a fan, these are a really nice item to pick up. So there's the first one and the second one. And then I picked up this Crayola mini coloring pages Shopkins and I had purchased these before and my daughter absolutely loved this. They um, are a great size to carry in a bag or purse and they're great for the car. They have 80 mini coloring pages and six mini washable markers. And that's what it looks like. So it has your coloring page to the right and your markers 
are nicely tucked in the cover on the left. So this is a really nice thing to pick up should you see them if you have a little one. They are great. I found some new decor pieces and I seen this hauled in one video that I watched and I was glad that they came to my Dollar Tree. These will look great in my daughter's room. So I did pick up a few of them just to add them in her room. The first one says magical and it has a unicorn with a rainbow and a little bit of glitter. So pretty. So it's just this thin, um, kind of like a MDF, and then it sits in this stand here. The second one that I picked up says happiness, laughter, and love. Again, a little bit of glitter, really nice colors. And then the third one, which I love the colors on this, has pineapples and the saying says work that crown. Just really nice. So it is, um, it has the picture on the front but on the back it's just brown but really cute. I came across this elephant and I love elephants. It came in silver and gold but I do like the silver really nice detailing on it as well so I thought that was a nice find I picked up a couple boxes of the copper wire LED lights I normally pick up a couple here and there every time I go in just to add to my supply I also picked up a few of these storage jars from Cooking Concepts. I love these. These are the little miniature mason jars. I love that they're glass and they have the metal, metal lid. They're great for spices or I also like using them for my paints. Just really nice. I found some new socks this time around at the Dollar Tree. Now these ones are not seasonal, but they are really cute. So the first one here has rainbows and diamonds and stars. And I just really love the colors. That is an ankle sock. These ones are crew socks and it says mermaizing and it has a mermaid's tail splashing in the water. Really cute. This one here, again a crew sock, and it says shine bright. And the last crew sock that I picked up has a unicorn on it, and it says, I think it says, something underneath it says nothing is impossible I picked up this tray I really like these trays just for if you're having a party or just for company they're a nice size and I like how they look as well so I just happen to see it and grab one I picked up a couple of these baskets from essential essentials and um, ideal for countertops and shelf storage and I just like these. I think they're really nice quality baskets and I like when I find them in brown because I don't always see them in the brown. So I picked up a couple. I picked and up quite a few seasonal items this time around and the first thing I came across were these really nice gift boxes and I love, love this pattern or design with the mugs and it says wishing you a cozy holiday. So I found them in this large, medium and small. 
I don't know if there was one bigger than this. These were the three sizes that I saw. And they just open up in the center here. Like that. And I really like these. So I picked up the three different sizes. I picked up some cards and there were a few that I really thought were just so pretty. The first one here has this deer and the white winter scene and it says season's greetings and I just love the white and the blue. This one was pretty cute with the sweater and then it had this red and white striped jute twine and it says, tis the season to be jolly. And then of course, to go along with the hot chocolate and this one here I thought was just so pretty. Again, the jute twine or the string, red and white striped. And then it has this mug that's sticking out and it has the red and white straw and it says warmest wishes with the deer on the front. I really love this one. So pretty. I ended up picking up some more treat bags. So again with the mug of hot cocoa, the gingerbread and these peppermint candies, you get 20 counts in this package. So I picked those up. I needed a couple of the basket bags and I just picked up this one here with the holly berries and then the second one that I picked up has these snowflakes all over them in the green, red and white. These loot bags I love when I come across these and these were too cute and it says let it snow with the snowmen and you get six loot bags for $1.25 and they're a nice size. I picked up a bag. This one here was probably one of my favorites and I'm pretty sure I didn't find it last year. I know I had seen it hauled but I seen it this year and I just love it. And it says, go tell it on the mountain that Jesus Christ is born. It's so pretty. I picked up a couple more decor signs. These ones were really fun. I just love the snowmen. And it says, baby, it's cold outside. I love the same and I just love the blue and white. And then this one I was very excited to find to go along with my hot cocoa station. Have a cup of cheer. I came across another of the pine branch that I hauled in my I don't know if it was my last one or the one before that but I just really have not been able to find these I am sure to guess that as soon as they get these in they sell out because they are beautiful and they are a really really nice size it's at least two feet and again you get the pine cones the spirals the berries and the pine that just looks really really nice and realistic not cheap looking at all so I could only find one but even if I find one here and there I'm sure to gather quite a few I don't remember if I saw these before I don't think I have but this is the first time I'm seeing them this year if I did see them last year I just can't remember it's an ornament garland. It's six feet and they are the balls and they are on the plastic um, 
the ball string, I guess they're called. Kind of like the necklaces that they normally send, uh, sell. So I thought that was a really nice find. You get some that are frosted and then some that are metallic. So I picked up a couple packages of those. I should have put this with the other gift boxes that I found but this one is a gift card holder and there were a few different patterns but I liked this one the best and it says Jolly and then when you open it up you just place your gift card to from and the amount and I thought that was really cute I picked up a couple of fun novelty pens so the first one that I picked up says elf advice and I'm guessing that the saying in here switches and they say be jolly eat candy smile big spread Xmas cheer make a snowman and sing songs so every time you click the top of the pen, it changes to a different saying. And then the second one I picked up is the naughty or nice pen. So we have definitely nice, you're getting coal, a little naughty, very nice, a little too nice, and definitely naughty. So I thought those were fun. I came across some scarves, and this one I absolutely love. It is a woodland theme scarf. It has this adorable little log cabin, and then it has cardinals and let me see here if I can open it up it has foxes it has deers and squirrels so I thought this was a really really pretty scarf and I just love the blue in the scarf along with the other colors so I picked up a couple of those I came across this door, what do they call it? Door hanger. And this one is frozen themed with Anna and Elsa in the center. And being that my daughter's room has Anna and Elsa, I thought this would be cute to hang on her door. I came across another headband that I hadn't seen last time and again anything deer related I love and these were too cute to not bring them home and then I also found they had these head wraps and they are reindeers they also had elves but I like the reindeer and then it has the three jingle bells in the center and then it just opens and stays fastened with the velcro in the back so I picked up a couple of those and then I also found this wired edge ribbon it is nine feet and I just loved the red and white pattern on this and if you didn't see my last DIY, it was the farmhouse red truck banner. And when I'm ready to switch it out from fall to winter, I will be adding some bows and this is the ribbon that I will be using. I just think it's so pretty. So I did get a few of those. These plates were a really nice find for me today. I myself had not seen these before. They are the poinsettia print and I absolutely love these plates. I love the detailing in the poinsettia. It almost looks like they're three-dimensional 
and I just love that the red is not like a bright vibrant red it's more muted and again the detailing in the poinsettia and the green as well is a, you know a more muted green mixed with the gold I just think it looks the colors work so beautifully together so I picked up the larger plate the smaller plate and then of course the mug and I just think that they make a beautiful beautiful set and yes I saved the red truck for the last items to show you I saved the best for last and I was really excited and happy to see that they really did bring out a lot more items with the red truck. So the first thing that I picked up here is this card. And I noticed that they really do pair the red truck with the red and black buffalo check. So this is not the red truck. However, it is the vintage car or station wagon with the tree on top and it says there is no place like home for the holidays really pretty I found a gift card holder that says Merry Christmas and it has the red truck as well as the snowman in front so I thought that was cute the treat bags they also had the red truck and it says have yourself a merry little Christmas and these again are 20 counts per package and then I also found the loot bags which have six in a package adorable and I found some boxes but there was not many left and whatever I saw left on the shelf I grabbed so in total that was five boxes this was was the largest size that I found however it was different from the other ones because the other ones have the glitter and this one did not so it says have yourself a merry little Christmas and when you open it up it has this nice red, green, and white plaid design on the inside. They make these boxes so pretty. And then I found three sizes in this box. So it has the glitter on the front, and then again the buffalo check, the red and black, and then the inside has another green, red, and white plaid design. So pretty. So this was the large. Then they had a smaller size and then an even smaller size. So I was pleasantly surprised. I still haven't found the red truck wrapping paper and I'm really surprised but I just really think that as soon as these red truck items come in they sell out super quick so I was glad to find what I did and it was a fun and exciting day at the Dollar Tree so that'll do it for this Dollar Tree haul I really hope that you enjoyed it if you did please give it a thumbs up share the video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already and as always, guys, you take care of yourselves, and I hope to catch you in my next video. Bye-bye.